know, when I, when I think of York, to me, its greatest quality is its humane scale. And again, we've, we've looked at that with the City Council to actually try and articulate what makes York special. Why is it different to Cambridge? Why is it different to Oxford? And the City Council and John Oxford, City Archivist, wrote a brilliant paper, the Heritage Topic paper, and we identified six qualities. And one of those qualities is York's compactness. And I help try and people understand this. Its compactness is also about its humane scale. Um, the medieval burgage plots in York are a set width, and they're a width normally determined by the largest trees available to, to make um, beams to build roofs from. So York has this scale that people re have related to for hundreds of years. It also, though, is so compact that actually it only takes 20 minutes to walk across it. And in that time, you'll probably bump into five people you actually know. So York's very much about this human interaction. It's about talking, it's about bumping into people, it's about traversing it very quickly and very readily. And I think that's a fascinating thing. You're not going to get a solution here unless you actually understand that humane scale and get humans involved in that conversation. Because ultimately, we're the people who bring the value and value this place. So again, to me, that sorting out the eye of York is about having a conversation about the whole of York. What is York? What does it mean? And that's just an endless, massive, big fantastic conversation.